Hello, children's. Mr. Bruce here. Today's Mr. Bruce's book is a holiday book, and it's called Hanukkah. A lot of different families celebrate different things at the holidays. Some people celebrate Christmas. Some people celebrate Kwanzaa. Some people celebrate Hanukkah, the Festival of Lights. So before we start, eyes watching, ears listening, voice is quiet, body calm. Okay. That's the Festival of Lights. That's a menorah. In darkest December, that's where we are now, what month we're in, night steals in early and whisks away the daylight. It does. It gets darker earlier every night, doesn't it? But warm inside, Mama, Papa, and Grandma, Grandma Rose, they light the sun. That's what they call a menorah. While Nora and Dan, Ruthie and Sam sing a song that is a prayer. They sing it every year. Birthday. Mo, little Mo, points and drops his bottle. Hot. No, not hot. Hanukkah, Sam says. Say Hanukkah. Hama, Hama, Hana. He can't really say Hanukkah yet. It's a hard word to say when you're little. Hanukkah. Come on, Nora whispers to the others. While the candles burn bright, five small children slip out of sight. Nora and Dan in the kitchen fry some batter. Flip flap here, flip flop there. Potato pancakes in the air. Latkes flying everywhere. And when they drop one, who steals away with it? That's right, the dog. Ruthie, in the bedroom, mixes some paint, a drop of blue, a drop of red, a drop of purple. Up, oh, it lands on the rabbit's head. She's drawing. While off in a corner, tucked away, Sam shakes a dreidel out of clay. A dreidel is like a top that you spin around. Tops, Mo shouts. Yes, it's a dreidel for Hanukkah. Say Hanukkah, Mo. He can't say it yet. And he drools on Sam's foot. Babies can't say Hanukkah. And that's what a dreidel looks like. Then, one by one, their gifts in hand, the children gather round. Grandma carries her favorite dish, pot roast warm, brown and rich. Papa brings his salad, cool and crisp, and Mama her applesauce. Delicious, says Baby Mo. The latkes have landed. Those are the potato pancakes. The latkes have landed, Sam shouts, holding out his plate. Mo grabs one, unable to wait. And as the Hanukkah candles lean head to head, so does the family. Mmm, they're getting sleepy after eating. It was just Thanksgiving and now it's Hanukkah. But wait, there's more. There is no escape. It's Grandma's famous lemon cake. Mm -mm -mm. And cookies and candy and fruit and nuts. Now that's all. Enough's enough. Time for presents. What a party. For songs, for dances, and one thing more. Love, light, Hanukkah. Say Hanukkah, Mo. Come on, Sam says. Say Hanukkah. Anu, Anuka. Mo shouts and hugs Sam. Hanukkah. Happy Hanukkah. And as the candles burn low, and lose their light, eight sleepy people say, Good night. The end. That was a good one. Okay. 
We'll do some more holiday books before we get done for the holiday. Until then, be good to your folks and wash your hands. Bye-bye.